Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In this session, we will discuss uh, exam exercise that is 1.8 uh, from chapter 1 from uh, uh, topic of functions. And uh, in this exam exercise, question number 1, we have uh, uh, modulus 4x minus 5 is equal to 21. And we have to solve this one. So, question number 1. 4x minus 5 is equal to 21 so we will write it with the positive one and with the minus one because this could be a positive or a negative so for positive value x is equal to 13.2 and for negative value it's a x is equal to minus 4 so we have two solutions uh, question number 2 is case the graph of uh, y is equal to 3 plus 5x uh, Showing, uh, showing the coordinates of the point where your graph meets the coordinate axis and solve the equation 3a uh, plus 5x is equal to 2. So, for this uh, we have to plot this uh, at uh, y is equal to 0, x is equal to 3 upon 5. So this is minus 3 upon 5 which is 0. 0.6 and uh, at this value the value of uh, this uh, for x is equal to 0, this y is equal to 3. This is so this graph plotted and this is the reflection. And uh, <coughs> from this, so we have this vertices uh, 0 0.6 minus 0 0.60 and this is uh, intercept 3. So this was the requirement and the part B, we have to solve this 3 plus 5x is equal to 2. So we have to draw a line. 2 and it will be intercepted 2 positions so we will write this 2 here 2 with a, with a positive one and with a negative one and we have obtained these two solutions this is minus 0.2 and minus 1 so these are the two solutions one is here one is here uh, now the question number let's solve question number uh, 3 y is equal to 2x minus 5 solving the coordinates of the point where the graph meets the uh, coordinate axis and solve this 2x minus 5 is equal to 3. So question number 3 we have a y is equal to 2x minus 5 and we have sketched this this is 2x minus 5 for y is equal to 0 x is equal to 5 uh, 5 upon 2 that is 2.5 and uh, for uh, x is equal to uh, y is equal to uh, 0 x is equal to 2.5 for x is equal to 0 y is minus 5 so minus 5 is at, at this point but it is since it is a uh, modulus method so this is 5 will go rather than going this direction it will go up this one so this is plot here and uh, from this plot we have this vertices 5 2 comma 0 and the intercept is 5 so this is the first part and the second part is uh, we have to find uh, a 3 so 2x minus 3 2, uh, 2x minus 5 is equal to 3 2x minus 5 is equal to minus 3 and from this we have this two solution x is equal to 4 or x is equal to 1 so this is one solution and this is another solution uh, question number Question number 4, uh, a function is that f is equal to 3x minus 1 uh, for minus 10 to 8, find the range of x, f. So we have to find the range minus 10 to 8. So we will uh, we'll plot this curve and write down the suitable domain for f, for which f inverse exists. This is f uh, 3x square minus 1 for minus 10 to 8. So this is uh, for minus 10 we have uh, 299 and uh, for uh, 0 we have minus 1 and uh, range is minus 1 uh, to minus 1 to uh, uh, minus 10 is the maximum value because this will give the maximum. So this is the range minus 1 and 299 and uh, uh, for part b because 1 to 1 requirement is satisfied 
so this is one to one so the requirement is satisfied and question number uh, Five. Uh, the function f and g x are defined for real values of x by f x is equal to under root x minus one minus three for x is greater than one and g x is equal to x minus two two x minus three for x is greater than two. Find g f thirty seven. Find an expression f inverse x. Find the expression g inverse x. So question number five. So this is uh, a function x and function g x. G f x is given as uh, g f x. So we will replace this f x in place of this x g x. So this is x minus one under root minus three here. In place of this, we have under root x minus one minus three, and we we'll solve this one. So this is simple. G f x, and this is thirty seven is placed. So thirty seven is placed here. Thirty seven is placed here. This is 36, which is 6, 6 minus 3, and this is minus 2. This is 6, 36 minus or 37 minus 1 is 36, which is 6 minus 3. So this is simple. This is uh, 3 minus 2. This is 2, 3 minus 3. To the 6 minus 3 is 3. This is 1. So this is simple. Apparently, it looks very difficult, but it is very simple. F inverse uh, x is this simple. If uh, Y is equal to under root x minus one minus three. Uh, x minus one is equal to y plus three. Uh, taking square on both sides, x is minus one in this. So, so x is equal to y plus three square plus one. So f inverse x is x plus three square plus one. So the C part, B part, so y is equal to x minus two to x minus three. So rearranging, and we have this x is equal to three y minus two. 2 by minus 1, so we can write this g inverse x, and this is 3x minus 2, and 2x minus. 1. So this is possible. Uh, in the next session, we will discuss question number 6 to 